Right now, we're learning high school or high cholesterol isn't just a problem for adults anymore. Researchers are now uncovering it could also be an issue for your kids. Well, we're taking action for your health with what you can do today to help your children avoid this potential health danger. Leonardo and Camilla Galindo love playing in the park, which may be why their cholesterol levels, when last checked, were normal. But a new study released today says about one in every three kids between 9 and 11 have worrisome levels of cholesterol that could lead to heart disease. That doesn't surprise their mom, Blanca, who thinks she knows why. Food and exercises. Exercises more because they just sit home. They don't, they play in the games, the video games. Texas Children's Hospital researchers examined the medical records of about 13,000 kids between the ages of 9 and 11. They had a cholesterol screening as part of a routine physical exam. And what they found out is that boys were more likely than girls to have higher total cholesterol and higher bad cholesterol. Almost a third of both sexes had some elevation. Cardiologist Mohammed Tabesh says the guidelines to screen both girls and boys that young are already in place, but he doesn't know how many pediatricians actually follow through. It's still a little bit controversial because we don't know what to do with the information. There's not good data as far as um, why or who and how you treat these patients if you do find elevated levels. Statins work for many adults, but have side effects. We obviously want to try at all costs non-pharmacologic non uh, therapy. Um, change in lifestyle, change in diet. And those changes could include more family outings to the nearest park. So here's what you can do today. Have your child's cholesterol checked during their next physical. Read labels so you can limit cholesterol and saturated and trans fat intake. Eat healthy snacks that are low in fat and cholesterol, such as fruit, raw vegetables and low-fat dips, plain unsalted popcorn or pretzels, or low-fat yogurt and gelatin. And exercise because it helps elevate the HDL or good cholesterol in your blood.